Thank you, Joe. The Finger Lakes Boating Museum is taking up a restoration project of a 39-foot boat that is more than 90 years old. Tonight, the museum laid out its plans for how it's going to bring the boat back to life and what they're going to do with it. WENY-TV's Nick Quattrini joins us now in the studio with a story. Nick? John, rehabilitating a boat of this size and age is a lot of work. So much work, the museum is asking for your help. No matter what skill set you have, anyone can pitch in. You're looking at the PAT-2. Built in 1924 and measuring in at 39 feet, it spent 30 years as a tour boat on the St. Lawrence and then as a U.S. mail boat on Lake Skinny Atlas until the late 1960s. The Finger Lakes Boating Museum in Hammondsport acquired it just last year with the goal of getting it back in the water. We're not going to completely rebuild the boat. There's a lot of the boat that's salvageable as it is. Um, most of the structural members will have to be replaced or reinforced, but uh, yeah, the skin of the boat is in pretty good shape. The project is expected to last two years, and there's plenty of work to do, including structural and mechanical repairs. Once finished and relaunched, the boat will be symbolic, as the project is the largest of its kind for the museum. The immediate uh, intention is to have it uh, moored at a dock here in Hammondsport. Uh, for the uh, to serve as the museum's flagship. With the project being completely volunteer-based, Jeff Heath, the boat restoration leader, says this project would provide a great learning opportunity. We're trying to keep it as interesting and as much fun as we can. We can find something for anybody that's interested in working on it, um, no matter what their level of skill is. We can um, uh, find something uh, for them to do. Now, if you're interested in helping out, check out our website, WENY.com, and click on the story for more information. Reporting in the studio, Nick Quaterni, WENY News.